What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. So I'm back again with another review from a product I ordered off of Wish. This time I ordered some uh, Figma body figures. Uh, I sketch a lot and do various kinds of art. Um, and normally these things go for like 40 bucks to, I've seen some ranging to, I don't know, 60, even 70 dollars for specialty ones. Um, and on the website itself, on the application of Wish, I don't know how well you guys can see this. Let's see if I can get that to focus. Ah, there we go. It is going for $6.80 for a whole set. So let's dive into this and see what the quality of this is really like. So I haven't opened this yet. Well, I did open the bottle, but I haven't opened these individually. So here we go. All right. Nothing else in the package here. Made in China, like most of the things on this website. Alright. They uh, seem like they're sealed. Doesn't seem like there's anything torn or messed up with it. So I couldn't find my box cutter, so I'll use one of my little wood carving tools here. Just to kind of get this open a little bit. Try not to cut through. There we go. Let's put this off to the side. Okay, so package number one. Here we go. Okay. Zoom out a little bit. Okay, nothing else in that package. So here's the, the male little uh, figure. Let's try to focus this for you guys. Uh, zoom in a little bit more. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So this is the male figure. Uh, it's actually pretty well done. I am surprised. Let me get this back in focus. It comes with a stand. Um, Few different hands uh, and some feet. I am actually really surprised at the quality of this for the price. Uh, once again this came from China. I don't know what this says on the packaging other than this is awesome. Alright so I'm excited to use these. Let's open the next one shall we? So that was the male figure. Put that off to the side. And here's the female figure. Uh oh. Don't know if I cut it enough. Let's see. Make sure there's nothing else in here. Nope. Off to the side. Voila. And the female figure. It's actually really well made. I am surprised at all these joints. It's a little smaller than I expected. You know, it's um, close to, I don't know what size this is because I can't read the writing. Let's see. Yeah, not sure what size this is, but it's actually uh, a lot smaller than I thought it would be. You know, I can palm this whole thing. Um, but that's not a problem for me. It doesn't matter. Um, wow. Okay. This comes with the stand as well. A few different hand poses. Zoom in. i just bring it to you. Go. I'm like eager to bust these open and just kind of play around with them. Feel like a kid again. All right, let's zoom out. Yeah. All right. So, not quite sure what to do. Next, I'm kind of winging this right now. Let's set one of these up, shall we? Let's see if I can open this without it exploding everywhere. Okay. Off the back. wasn't sealed as much as I thought. It's just one little piece of tape. All right, so we'll come to the side. Comes with a little booklet, kind of explaining uh, how this works. Although it comes in a different dialect. And I don't know what it says, but it's okay. 
Alright, so this is just taped. So I'm gonna just try to peel this away. tape on this thing. Alright, so now, there we go. One more piece. Alright, try not to cut myself while opening this. An itty bitty little figurine. This thing is dope. There's all these little rotating, uh, there we go. The face is kind of creepy looking, but it's okay. You see all the little balls and stuff in the neck. You can kind of get all kinds of crazy poses. Hey, what? Shake. Okay, so. Let's, oh, oh wow, oops. Simple little ball joint there kind of popped out. Broke it already, look at that. Oh man. Gotta figure out which way this thing bends. Okay. That's hilarious. Okay. I'm trying to maneuver these little joints without breaking this thing. It does kind of feel a little fragile. Uh, pelvis kind of tilts. That's cool. pretty cool. Alright, so let's get this stand. Figure out how this thing works. And it looks like this just. Ooh, I'm on the focus. Okay, it looks like a little octagon shape. It doesn't really matter which end I put, hopefully. I don't want to force this either. I'm going to mess around and break it the first day. Alright, um... I don't know if it really matters. It doesn't seem like it does. So, let's poke that in there. Cool, got our stand. There's a tiny little hole. On the little figure's back. And then there's a separate little piece right here. Looks like it goes in the back. Oh man. Don't break the new figure. Okay, I think that's good enough. Try to click this in place. There we go. Try to... Yep, yeah, there we go. Okay. So, the stand has a bunch of joints itself. So, it seems like you can get a good amount of like movement from this. Uh oh. Or maybe not. If you break it like that. Jeez. Alright. Stay. Cool. Sorry, I'm just playing around with the new toy. <laughs> but, yeah, this thing. Uh, looks pretty awesome. Like I said, it's it was six bucks versus paying like what forty something dollars if you were to buy it from various sites. There's different brands, true, and they all offer slightly different things. Um, some come with other accessories like hands and feet. Some don't. Uh, some are specialty ones, so you'll have one that looks like a character from uh, One Punch Man or something like that. It just kind of varies on what you're purchasing. I just got the very bare basic minimum thing. Oh my god, the foot came off so easy. So I am noticing these do seem to come off kind of easy. I didn't intend to do that. But yeah, the detail and the smaller things like the hands and the feet are actually really well done. I'm hoping I can zoom in enough where you guys can see this. Um, there we go. See little toes? Got the little toes, even has like little nail on the toes. So they really went all out with the detail. And like I said, this is six bucks for a two and a stand. That's crazy. Um, this came at the exact time that it said it was going to. It didn't arrive earlier like some of the other items I had purchased before, um, which isn't a problem. Um, just letting you know. But yeah, I am completely satisfied with this purchase. Um, so, with that being said, we've gone on a little too long. <laughs> so 
So be sure to like, subscribe, ask me any questions that you have. Um, I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. And I'm going to keep playing around with this. Hopefully I don't break the thing on the first day of getting it. But um, yeah, that's really cool that they have all these little movable joints. And you can really get good poses so when you're getting your art on, you know, you can get pretty creative. Cool. Anyway, guys. Oh, dang. With that being said, and with me breaking things, bye!